helicopter has a, a large variety of weapons. We have the uh, rockets in the front, rockets in the back. You have a flamethrower in the front. You have the uh, the Gatling type guns on the hoods. Uh, you have oil squirters on the rear. Um, we had also machine guns and the door jam on the, I guess that was the second version of the car where actually, you know, Kata could open his driver's door and it had guns in the door jam, you know? So uh, just all sorts of fun stuff, just lots of destruction, you know, it was, uh, it was all great. We just added a lot more horsepower to them, for one. That was one of the, the big things. Um, you know, basically probably close to double what the car originally came with. Um, we did, you know, suspension upgrades, uh, sway bars, all, all sorts of stuff, just to make the car handle better and do the stunts. You know, the, the last thing you want is for the uh, director to, you know, request a car does something and the stunt guy says, hey, this car's not capable of doing it. So we tried to make sure that every car was built to do what it needed to do, you know, at any given moment. So just a lot of performance upgrades. It was uh, just a lot of variations. I mean, actually, in the film, there's more than one car. So uh, a lot of them get destroyed, a lot of them get wrecked. Uh, it evolves as it goes through the story uh, with different gags. Um, and the reason we needed so many was because things weren't necessarily shot in order. So we might, you know, destroy a car, but then have to come back and have a clean car or vice, you know. So it was just, you know, you're always kind of chasing it, trying to get stuff ready for the following day.